This episode is called Justice Denied, and the first thing I'm sure people have noticed, we have not been on the air with new programs for like six years now. They just, we've been on a, a hiatus for almost the entire, the entire month of March. It's our first episode back. We've been shooting and working while the network has been putting on other people's shows, and we're back. Uh, and the first episode back is, I think, one of the best ones of the season. It's, uh, it's called Justice Denied. It's the story, the crime story in the episode is about a man wrongly sent to prison in 2004. And we actually begin with footage from an SVU in 2004. It's kind of cool just to, we, we have a real flashback. Um, but we're picking up this case eight years later when a, another rape occurs and it's the same MO as the rape of 2004. And Olivia Benson knows it's the same guy. She knows who did it the minute she goes to the crime scene. The only problem is the guy she knows, the guy she sure did it has been in prison for the last eight years and there's no way he could have committed the crime. At first we think it's a copycat and then we start pursuing other theories like maybe she sent the wrong guy away. This happens a lot in the real world. No cop is perfect, no DA is perfect. Uh, Olivia probably comes closer to being perfect than most of them. But what happens to her when she begins to question her own, the choices she made eight years ago and question her own gut?